Listen, we're going to be powers, man. But the Lord is going to give us the keys to this universe. We're going to unlock a level in this universe, a code in this universe, a vibration in this universe that these devils dream of unlocking. They dream about being a god. They want to be a god so badly. And they believe that if time was to go on for long enough, they would be able to research and make themselves into God. But only Yahweh Sham Shai can make you into a true God. And that gift is reserved for the children of Israel, beginning with the elect. But ye shall receive power after that the Holy Spirit has come upon you. So after receiving the understanding of the word and the ability to teach it, you are going to receive power, that spiritual power. Jeremiah 16 and 16. Behold, I will send for many fishes, saith the Lord. We're the fishes. Again, fell the apostle Tom down, man. We're the fishes. We're fishing, and the bait is the Bible. We're fishing for the elect. But we understand that this truth is only for the elect. Behold, I will send for many fishes, saith the Lord, and they shall fish them. Hey, didn't thou shall tell Peter he will make him fishes of men? There you go. And after will I send for many hunters, so the fishes are going to turn into hunters. Pursuant to the scriptures, the Lord is going to give us spiritual power. Alright? And the fishes are going to turn into hunters. And they shall hunt them from every mountain. That's you niggas. And Esau too. And just you niggas. After we, you know what? After we're done with these niggas, we're going to go for you, Esau. We'll come for you. Because you're the ultimate nigga. I will send for many hunters, and they shall hunt them from every mountain and from every hill and out of the holes of the rocks. So the Heavenly Father, He gonna give us spiritual power, man. That's the real power. Spiritual power is much more powerful than a gun, than a bomb or a tank. It's with spiritual power, you can go into the mind of somebody and really fuck them up. Oh yeah. The example of spiritual power is the movie Lawnmower Man. Isaiah 41 and 15. Here's your lawnmower man right there. Isaiah 41 and 14. Fear not thou worm Jacob. And this is referring to the elect of Israel. Start with them first. And you men of Israel. Why the Lord call us a worm? Because we ain't got no power. The worm ain't got no power. The worm can't put up no resistance. Because the worm has no power. So we don't have no power right now. But the Lord said he will give us power. Fear not thou one Jacob, ye men of Israel, I will help thee. How's he gonna help us? Let's read on. Saith the Lord, and thy Redeemer, the Holy One of Israel, Behold, I will make thee a new sharp threshing instrument having teeth. That's a lawnmower man right there. The lawnmower man.